Thank you. Um, first, I am uh, privileged to be able to congratulate Adam on this adventure. It was a dream of his that I saw flashing across his so <laughs> I think that he'd be lucky if he gets uh, out of fair dues. He pursued it night and morning and week after week. And um, it's here and plays as well mm -hmm. to uh, just say that um, Salmon for you know, bringing out that uh, edition. It's uh, important not only for Ireland, obviously, for us here in this country, but for uh, the many uh, thousands or tens of thousands of um, students of Irish studies across the world. The Irish studies is a very serious entity now, not only on the North American continent and <coughs> the US being provided, but also in Canada increasingly, and also, and not only there, but also in South America, Argentina and other countries, Japan, Australia. So uh, I hope that uh, the word gets round on this and that there's a copy for students in, in every library. <coughs> mm. uh, my poem machines on uh, tractors, uh, number 15, and uh, preface by a uh, quote from Many times man lives and dies between these two eternities, that of race and that of soul, an ancient pirate we will all know. Pushing the tractors, it's not for them, the shitty meniality of clay. They would grow old in an instant, crushing it, feet on mere earth, they will not it. Their chosen cab temperature rhythm arrives. They enjoy the ride, their bums on seats, heated for cold and foggy, tearing an oak. Who knows what's on their mind, in it, organics, or the latest deep coupling news, or appearing zones to be stockproofed. He throws to output, lit up fields at night, who will never alight, throws a paddock gate. Mere mortals below them, we look to serious disease control and listen out for bells. Thanks, <laughs> 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 <laughs>